Barakata Yahawa, Barakata Yahusha, Barakata Yahawa, Barakata Yahusha, Bahashem Rakagodash. Double honor to the apostles, the elders, salutations to you, sincere brothers, teaching in truth and in sincerity. This lesson will be entitled Bill Gates says life will return to normal only my source rt.com and this article is entitled bill gates says life will return to normal only after second generation of covid vaccines rolled out and virus eliminated globally this article was posted on the 12th of october 20 20. Technology tycoon Bill Gates said life can get back to normal only when a second generation of COVID-19 vaccines is widely available and the virus is eradicated worldwide. A higher bar than was set for any disease in history. And here's why. Job 5 and 12. He, referring to Yahweh Bashem Yahushai, disappoint the devices, hence COVID-19, of the crafty, hence the nobility of Edom, because they control this entire system, beginning with the Rothschilds, trickling down to the other 12 Edomite families, so that their hands, meaning what? Their might, their will, going into their council cannot perform their enterprise and their enterprise is identified as the new world order which is also their success the only way we'll get completely back to normal is by having maybe not the first generation of vaccines but eventually a vaccine that is super effective and that a lot of people so like it, and that's a lot of the people take and that we get the disease eliminated on a global basis now remember they want to reduce the world's population to 500 million. Gates said Sunday in an interview on NBC's Meet the Press program, that is where we can finally start talking. So like if that is where we can finally start taking all the problems that have been created in education, mental health, and start to build back in a positive way. According to that standard, Americans might need to live for years or for life under social distancing guidelines and other COVID-19 restrictions. It's certainly gloomier than the assessment Gates gave in a Fox interview last month when he said progress on vaccines might make it possible for a return to normalcy in the U.S. by the summer of 2021. He said he expects several of the first generation of vaccines to get emergency approval by early next year. And that's pretty much That's pretty much it. And they want you Israelites to take this vaccine, which are you so-called Negroes, so-called Hispanics, and you so-called Native Americans, you Israelite foreigners who on your father's lineage goes back to Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. They want us 
eradicated from the earth. Psalm 83 and 3, they have taken crafty counsel, referring to the nobility of Edom, against thy people, referring to the Israelites, and consulted against thy hidden ones. The hidden ones are us Israelites. However, at this time frame, the Most High has shed light upon his people. Hence, the prophets out there prophesied letting our people know who they truly are. Beginning with the apostles of Great Millstone. Verse 4, they have said, come and let us cut them off from being a nation. Why? Because they want that birthright. Spoken of in Genesis, the 27th chapter, that the name of Israel may be no more in remembrance. Okay. Last precept. And this is Second Corinthians two and eleven. Least Satan and Satan's physical manifestation on earth is the nation of Edom should get an advantage of us. How so? Through their so-called media, through their so-called research, okay? Through so-called COVID-19 and any other agenda, they're pushing for the attainment of the new world order. For we are not ignorant of his devices. And the reason why we are not ignorant, all praises to Yahweh Bashem Yahushah. First John 2 and 20. But ye have an unction. And in the Greek, this means a calling from the Holy One, Yahweh Bashem Yahushah, through his son Yahushah. And ye know all things. All right. So we understand the crafty devices of Satan through the Holy Spirit. All right. Lord will your edify Shalom.